Imagine a battlefield of the future. Drones fly overhead, helicopters move in for an attack, and enemy strike aircraft approach from the horizon. It seems impossible to escape. But then the flying tiger, Hanwha K-30 Baiho, takes position. This machine can destroy an airborne threat in seconds. How does it work? What is its secret? Let's find out. The K-30 Baiho is a South Korean self-propelled anti-aircraft gun and missile system. It was specifically designed to protect mobile troops and key assets from low-flying threats. Imagine a combat vehicle that doesn't just shoot at the sky but tracks, calculates, and eliminates an enemy before they even realize they've been spotted. The development of Baiho began back in the 1990s. South Korea needed a system capable of countering Soviet and Chinese aircraft that could threaten its airspace. Engineers at Hanwha Defense proposed a universal solution, a combination of automatic cannons and missiles. The K-30 Baiho is built on the armored chassis of the K-200 tracked personnel carrier. This gives it excellent mobility. It can traverse rough terrain, climb hills, and maneuver in places where regular truck-mounted anti-aircraft systems would get stuck. The main weapon of the Baiho is 230mm Erlikon KCB automatic cannons. These guns fire up to 1,200 rounds per minute. To put it into perspective, if you started counting from 1 to 1,000, the cannons would have fired more rounds than you could say numbers. But cannons have their limits. Their range is about 3 kilometers. What if the enemy attacks from further away? This is where the second part of the system comes into play, missiles. In the upgraded version, the K-30 Baiho is equipped with Shingung missiles. These are South Korea's equivalent of the American Stinger. They can hit targets up to 7 kilometers away. Imagine an enemy helicopter flying at low altitude. The Baiho operator spots it using the radar. They press a button and one of the cannons starts firing. The helicopter tries to evade, but a missile is already on its way. There is no chance to escape. Another advantage of the Baiho is its fire control system. The vehicle has a radar that detects targets up to 20 kilometers away. Additionally, Baiho is equipped with a thermal imaging system, allowing it to see enemies even in darkness or bad weather. The engine is powerful, 520 horsepower. The top speed is 60 kilometers per hour. The operational range is 500 kilometers. This means Baiho can move with the main forces and always be in the right place for defense. The K-30 Baiho was developed for South Korea, but other countries have shown interest. In 2018, India selected it for its army, but the deal later fell through. Nevertheless, Hanwha Defense continues to offer this system for export. Why is Baiho so valued by the military? It's simple. It is cheaper than full-scale air defense systems but still capable of shooting down aircraft, helicopters, and drones. In modern conflicts, drones play a huge role, and Baiho can defend troops against such threats. For example, imagine a scenario where a swarm of drones attacks a military base. Traditional air defense systems might be too slow to react. Baiho, thanks to its radar and rapid-fire cannons, could destroy dozens of drones in just seconds. However, Baiho has its weaknesses. Its armor protects only against small arms fire and shrapnel, but it is vulnerable to heavy missiles and artillery shells. Additionally, the system needs constant modernization to remain effective. In the 2020s, South Korea continues to improve Baiho. Work is underway to integrate new types of weaponry, including laser systems for countering drones. So, we have analyzed how the Hanwha K-30 Baiho works. It is a powerful and modern system capable of protecting troops from aircraft and drones. With its combination of cannons and missiles, it remains one of the best in its class. If you enjoyed this analysis be sure to like the video, comment on what you think about such anti-aircraft systems and subscribe to our channel. We have many more exciting military technology breakdowns ahead.